Hi, I'm Rich Quattrone, Manager of Product Training here at Pioneer, and I'm here to tell you about the most exciting and revolutionary audio-visual systems on the market today, the Pioneer series of laser optical disc players for home entertainment. Pioneer has long been the leader in laser optic research and design, and it's this technology that forms the basis for these systems and promises to sustain this extraordinary format as an industry standard well into the next decade. That means that with all the versatility these systems have to offer, you're not only making a wise audio-visual investment now, but you're buying into the future of sight and sound as well. But how, in an industry of ever-changing technologies, can we make such a bold statement? Well, to answer that question, let's first take a look at how far we've already come. Pioneer began its research into laser optics back in 1971. While many companies were focusing their attention on the video cassette recorder market, Pioneer was looking ahead to a product for the next generation, the laser optic video disc. Pioneer has continued to refine this laser technology ever since. Diligent research and experimentation with helium neon laser technology ultimately led to the introduction of the first laser video player for home use in 1980. In 1983, with the laser disc as its nucleus, Pioneer announced to the world that it was on its way to a new audio-video age by changing its corporate slogan from stereo of the world to the future of sound and vision. This announcement coincided with the introduction of a second generation laser disc player featuring a small solid state laser pickup. Such a feature made the new generation laser disc players more compact, gave them increased performance capabilities, and allowed them to be produced less expensively. Compact size, superior performance, attractive pricing. A perfect formula for success in the volatile home video market. Originally, several fixed speed motors were used to accommodate the various speeds required by the different discs. However, now in their fourth generation, these players feature a single variable speed motor which adjusts its speed according to the type of disc which is being played. By combining the knowledge of their powerful audio and video technology, Pioneer began to develop the multi-format combination laser disc players, which are capable of playing all forms of optical discs, including standard CDs, the three-inch CD, which plays 20 minutes of digital audio, CD videos that gives you a five-minute music video plus 20 minutes of digital audio, and the eight-inch and 12-inch laser discs, and future formats being introduced, such as eight-inch singles, a one-sided disc featuring up to 20 minutes of video and digital sound. Furthermore, the innovations accompanying these systems represent state-of-the-art advances in laser optical technology. At the heart of this technological wizardry is the laser disc itself. The disc contains billions of tiny bumps and pits. A laser beam from the pickup focuses very precisely on these pits. The reflection of light is converted into electric signals for audio and video reproduction. Therefore, it's imperative that the pits themselves are accurately placed on the disc. Since Pioneer actually manufactures most of the world's laser discs, they have developed a most demanding approach to the manufacturing process. Beginning with the production of a high quality release master tape, the program is encoded with various frame numbers, chapters, and control data. It's then ready for the production of a master disc or stamper. Extreme cleanliness is required for the mastering process. From the photoresistant coating placed on the glass mastering disc, laser beam recording, developing, metallizing, and nickel electroplating, to the final inspection of the formed stamper, all mastering procedures take place within a clean room environment. Once a satisfactory stamper has been made, the replication process can begin. This process also requires extreme cleanliness. The stamper is placed in an injection molding machine. From that, clear plastic replica discs are formed. These discs are then placed in a vacuum chamber which evaporates the protective aluminum coating which covers the pits. The final stage is the bonding of sides one and two into one disc. The completed LD is then packaged, wrapped, and shipped. Our manufacturing facility in Carson, California can produce up to 600,000 laser discs every month. You know, Pioneer prides itself in being the leader in laser optical technology. We continue to refine and improve our product to ensure that your dollars are not spent on yesterday's technology. 
The latest examples of this commitment are found in such features as Alpha Turn with dual centering design and picture window programming. Alpha Turn was developed so that both sides of an LD could be played without having to turn the disc over. This mechanism rotates the optical pickup carriage 180 degrees and moves it into position at the starting point on the other side of the disc. This all takes place in less than 15 seconds and some models will freeze the last frame on side one of the TV screen until play resumes with the first frame on side two. Since two sides of a given LD may not have identical centering spots, Pioneer provided our both side play units with a dual centering design. Two centering hubs, one for side A and one for side B, automatically adjust centering for the side which is being played. This effectively eliminates time-based errors which cause color distortion or picture jittering. The result is a smooth audio and visual flow from both sides of every LD. A special file feature which has been nicknamed Picture Window Programming is found on our higher end models. Unlike 20 track programming that you would find on our current CD players and combination Laserdisc players, this is a special feature just for Laserdiscs. This feature allows you to create program files for individual discs which remain in the player's memory indefinitely. Let me explain how this works. You can create files by titling your disc with up to 16 characters. This is done by naming and then selecting chapters or numbers on Laserdiscs or track numbers on CDs for the sections which you want to store. You can then go to your favorite music cuts, movie scenes, or informational segments almost instantly every time you load a disc with a program file assigned to it. You can create up to 60 of these individual files. And even if you turn your player off, whenever you insert a disc with a program file, the player will remember it and play it if you request it. Additionally, if the power cord is unplugged, the player will still retain its memory for days. It's a good idea to write the file number on the outside of the disc jacket. This is convenient for remembering which file you stored your favorite scenes in. As always, a complete step-by-step -step guide is located in your owner's manual. We encourage you to familiarize yourself with it. Additionally, advanced features such as SR remote compatibility allow all the basic Laserdisc functions to be controlled from any Pioneer receiver, amplifier, or projection TV that comes with a unified wireless remote control. The jog and shuttle allows you to freeze any frame or picture for careful study. It's fun to be able to stop the action in the middle of a scene to see how special effects are done. The outer shuttle ring lets you get to the scene you want to watch quickly at two times, five times, 10 times or 20 times normal speed. And the scanned picture is rock solid, unlike any videotape scanning. Features like this make Laserdisc players an attractive and logical alternative to current home video formats. Laserdisc technology isn't just another video fad destined for obsolescence while leaving unsuspecting consumers in its wake. Laserdisc has enjoyed a steady increase in popularity for the past nine years. Let's take a look at some facts in some key areas of comparison with VCRs and you'd be the judge. First of all, the greatest difference between LD players and video cassette players is in sound and picture quality. Clear, dynamic, noise-free sound from a digital laser disc is clearly superior to sound reproduced on any analog video cassette format. Just listen. In other words, compare Laserdisc's digital sound with an audio dynamic range of approximately 95 dB and a signal to noise ratio of 100 dB to the analog sound of conventional tape mediums such as Beta and VHS Hi-Fi and even Super VHS Hi-Fi. They just don't measure up. Laserdiscs give you the same audio sound quality of compact discs because the technology is very similar. Secondly, look at the picture. Tests have proven over and over again that Laserdisc picture quality is superior to that of VHS and SVHS formats. With a video signal-to-noise ratio of 47 dB, 
and picture resolution of approximately 425 lines, there's a visible difference between the VHS offering of 240 lines or even the 400 lines of SVHS. Translation, your laser vision picture will be consistently 40 to 60% sharper than any consumer video format currently available today. Specifications like that make it the ideal source format for large screen televisions, such as our Pioneer rear projection monitors. And please take note, I said the picture will be consistently sharper. There are several reasons for this. By design, the LaserDisc format is far more durable and easier to use than any tape format. Consider the basic principles behind the LaserDisc technology. No magnetic playback heads ever touch the discs themselves, so there's nothing to wear out. And the discs are extremely resistant to external hazards. For example, a magnetic field can't accidentally erase them like a videotape. Nor will food, dust, or dirt produce disastrous results. Simply wipe them clean and you're back in business. Try that with your favorite magnetic tape. And when you're done watching your favorite program, you don't have to rewind anything either. The next time you insert a disc, it's ready to play. Your discs will deliver the same crisp, clear sound and picture over and over again, whether it's the first, 50th, or 500th time you're playing them. The system delivers quality consistently. With performance like that, it's no wonder that LaserDisc has been the format of choice for movie buffs all along. And its permanent storage characteristics have served to make it a true collector's format. You can store your favorite movies and concerts vertically, just like your cherished record or CD collection. Of course, the discs aren't the only thing designed for durability. The laser optical pickup has been designed for up to 10,000 hours of continuous use before it may need replacement. That's like watching a two-hour movie every single night for the next 13 years. How many VCR video heads do you think you'd have to clean and replace in that amount of time? And mechanically, these players are far less complicated, which also makes for years of reliable service. There are so many other significant advantages of CDs and LDs compared to conventional tape formats. For instance, no tracking errors. Each disc is compatible from machine to machine without having to manually adjust for tracking like a VCR. The machine can also be left on a particular still frame indefinitely, and no damage to the software or the pickup will result. This is particularly useful when you want to study specific scenes or frames of information for extended periods of time. As you know, most VCRs are designed to shut off after a five minute pause. This is due to the fact that the video head constantly spinning at one point on a videotape will most likely cause damage to the tape or clog the video heads. Through true random access, you can easily and precisely locate a portion of a program you want to see without the time-consuming task of searching commonly associated with videotape. Imagine being able to access your favorite music video clip or movie scene instantly. And with our left-right independent audio channel feature, all kinds of possibilities become a reality. For example, movie dialogue with a narrator, or two different languages, or even beginner and advanced instructional scenarios may be encoded on the same program. You choose the one you want to hear. Watch this. As you see, he pulls the trees down, and they don't quite animate smoothly. And if you look at his fur, it's ruffling all over. And the reason it's ruffling is because it was rabbit fur. And every time they would animate, they would leave the fingerprints in it. And it wouldn't quite ever lay down in the same way. So they got around that by telling people that it was his muscles rippling. But it isn't really. Now, there are those who say that not being able to record with a laser optic system is a great disadvantage. In response, I ask one question. What would you record if it were possible? Nothing commercially available measures up to LD's specifications you wouldn't be able to utilize the system's full potential. And keep in mind that the ability to play and record always requires certain design compromises, such as the differences in videotape head gaps. On the other hand, LaserDiscs deliver the purest playback capabilities. Remember, you can't record on records or CDs either. 
Laserdisc isn't trying to replace a recording VCR medium. It's simply a superior playback-only video and audio source medium. It's fully compatible even with the most modest stereo and TV setups. For the person looking for a CD player or even a second VCR, consider the Laserdisc system instead. They're offered in a full range of models at competitive prices. Additionally, there are presently over 4,000 titles available on Laserdisc. Movies, concerts, and top hit music video titles are readily available, and many, many more are on the way. And this year, virtually all of the blockbuster movie titles will be simultaneously released both on Laserdisc and videotape. But the best news is, many of those titles are priced starting at $24.95. Compare that to videotape. Of special interest are subjects such as the works contained in the National Gallery of Art, the entire Grawlier's Encyclopedia, interactive games, and more. All merely serve as reminders that we've only begun to tap the full potential of integrating the Laserdisc into our lifestyles. And with the possibility of computer compatibility on the horizon, the LD system has definitely established itself as the benchmark format of audio and video files alike. And if you're thinking about a new or first-time CD player purchase, why not step up to a combination player? For a few extra dollars, you can buy into the technology of tomorrow and begin enjoying it today. Of course, all of the claims about Laserdisc's specifications, advantages, and superior performance are only half the story. It'll be your eyes and ears that tell you the whole story. We challenge you to compare the Laserdisc format to any other video or audio format currently available for the consumer market. We're sure that once you compare, you'll see and hear why we believe the format of the future is here today. Laserdiscs and Pioneer, the future of sound and vision. Thank you.